It's supposed to be a multi-purpose fighter bomber that can do both air defense and uh, strike. What differentiates it from a fourth generation fighter are two features which are very important. One is uh, the aircraft has low observability features, stealth. What this fifth generation also has is the development of this uh, all aspect sensing capacity. The deployment of sensors along the leading edge of the wings, uh, etc. So providing the pilot with basically a capacity to have a self-awareness uh, almost in a spherical sense in a way that fourth generation fighters with the exception of the latest model the f-15 which is being built does not have not really uh it's a modern very capable big heavyweight fighter bomber it's part of the whole su-2730 family uh, which has been developed over the last 30 years or longer uh, it's equivalent to basically uh, an upgraded f-15 they're having problems with developing a next generation engine and then finally they're having real difficulties in producing this in any numbers because of the dependence upon the supply of microprocessor and sensor technology from the west or the east in the case of asia and then finally is we're finding out that the russian aerospace defense industry for a variety of reasons just isn't capable of producing these types of advanced weapons very rapidly the pictures that people have cited that's the test base for the developmental aircraft so that may you know, in, in, in that sense, th this vehicle may not be being used in any operational tests, I would call them. If the use is happening, it's, I'm sure, episodic and almost experimental and tentative. This, this is not going to have any meaningful consequence on the outcome of this war from the air point of view. There's just too few of them. Um, the aircraft is still immature. They could have make an appearance, as they say. I mean, there's stories that allegedly one was flown to Syria to fly around and shoot off a few, uh, drop a few guided munitions and go home. Uh, to this day, that's a public domain claim. Uh, whether that was confirmed by Intel, uh, I don't know. 